Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Thursday the 30th of May 2024. I hope you are keeping well, feeling fresh and ready for a game of Sudoku. Uh, I certainly am ready for a game of Sudoku. Whether I'm feeling fresh or not, <laughs> I'm not sure. Anyway, I shall endeavour to play this game. This is New York Times Hard Level Sudoku Puzzle. It seems the consensus of regular human beings against the war that Israel, Israel is raging against Gaza continues to grow, although governments um, are still ignoring it. Um, I mention this because in Australia, uh, an open letter has been signed by 300 people, civil servants, 300 civil servants, who are actually people as well, believe it or not, uh, condemning uh, or ask, um, demanding that uh, Australia stops um, selling any arms to Israel, arms and um, weapons, etc. Um, but the Australian government denies that it's actually sold any, so we have no idea. Uh, there is a conf There are conflicting reports about whether arms have been sold to Israel from Australia uh, through private companies or not. Um, anyway, uh, people's voices keep growing louder in their utter abhorrence of what's going on in Israel. In, in Gaza, I should say, uh, particularly by the Israelis, of course by the uh, Hamas uh, as well, but in particular at the moment uh, Israel is bearing the brunt of criticism and I think quite rightly as well. All right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? I'm going to start this New York Times hard level puzzle with ones blocking up and down. And there's a bit of exercise for the ones. And I can see nines blocking up here and there. Oh, <laughs> sorry, nines blocking up here. Let me just delete that. Excuse me, you know what I meant. Nines blocking up here and there and across there is what I meant to say. There we are, live video. Nothing like it. <laughs> um. Ah, I think I've discovered a triple. I'm always on the lookout for these for these New York Times, if, if I can. I, I'm, I find them difficult to spot, but I've seen something here. Look, three, six, and eight blocking across here. That puts three, six, and eight into those squares there. There's no help on those, but we will at least know what goes there. It's not three, six, or eight. Uh, that means it's four and five. So let's see. That's going to put fives there and there. And it's going to put fours over there. Uh, okay, that's about it. So maybe we should look along here. So we've got four and five already. Then we're looking for one, seven, nine. That's going to put nines over there, which we knew already. And one, seven, I don't know. Hmm. Damn, I discovered that triple and it didn't appear to be very useful. It doesn't appear to have been very useful just yet. Uh, and the trouble is that I'm likely to forget that I found that. <laughs> That's the worst thing with having such poor memory. As I find these things and then I often forget that I found them earlier on. Right, we've got threes blocking like this. So we can at least say you're a three.
let's wander through the digits first of all, just see if we can pick up something useful. Ah, seven across there and seven down, oops, seven down there, I should say. Uh, it gives me a seven in that square. And put sevens over here. Okay, we've got one blocking down there, so there's our one, and then I think we've got nine across here, there's a nine, and that must be three. Uh, okay, so one blocks both of those squares and nine blocks both of those squares. So we definitely have one and nine over there. That's going to leave us here with, oh, four or five, which is, what <laughs> which is what I discovered before. I told you, didn't I? My memory is so appalling. I completely forgot that I found that. <laughs> okay, that's four or five. Uh, and this is three, six, eight, right? So now we know threes are there, There's still the six and the eight, we don't know yet. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Maybe I should join some blue figures. I definitely know that the fives are like this. I don't know if that helps me much, but just something, some blue, some blue on the board to help me remember things. It's always a bit useful. We have five. Ah, yeah, we have four, five there. Okay, so that right, I got you. Okay, so I'll just show you that for people who are not clear about this. Okay, five blocks this square. Five blocks this square. So five must be in one of these two squares. So it's got to be here or here. Can't be here because of this five there, right? And then over here, we found four and five already, so this can't be five, can it? That's got to be five. <sighs> Phew, it's hard work. <laughs> um, see, drawing in blue sometimes helps. Yeah. 
and now we've got seven blocking this square this square and this square so down there we've got seven and we've got a pair of seven nine across here seven nine blocking down there and we've got seven nine down there so i've found a pair of seven and nine in those squares now this is completely virgin territory so i'm not sure i'm going to be able to get anything else in here but anyway we do know it's seven nine. First of all, I think I'm going to look at these remaining squares in this column. This is seven and nine, so we're looking for three, uh, four, five, and we've got five blocking here and five blocking there. So that's our five. So that will give us three and four in those squares there, and we're a bit less sure about those. But anyway, uh, anyway, five across here and across there. Let's go off on a detour. That will put me five there. Okay, one blocking this square and one blocking this square. So in this column, there's a one. Uh, what are we left with? Six, nine, is it nine blocking there? Yeah, there's our nine. And this, I think, is a six. Yes, six. Six across here, six across there. There's our six. Now, I do remember this was four and five, so I can get this. This is going to be nine. And this was four, five, so this is three and eight. Still no news on that, but over here then, we're looking for two and we're looking for four, two and four. No, that's no good. And oh, actually, there's no three, five we've already got here, right? So that's not going to give us any joy there, but just for peace of mind, what and make sure that things are going okay. What is missing there? Seven and eight. Now we have one blocking across here, so that puts one into one of those squares, blocking up here, and one across there and across there. I can see then that threes appear in those squares there. What was this I worked out before? Seven and nine, wasn't it? Uh, now, have we got any changes on this yet? So, f seven, nine, that's three, four there. So, threes are there. Fours are there, there. Uh, I'm going to go around the clock again because, so, as I said, sometimes putting in blue squares can help visualize things a bit. So ones are in those squares. Twos are like this. Threes 
threes are like this. That's all the threes sorted out. Fours are hmm, like so. And then in the corner squares there. Uh, we had them there, didn't we? Okay, fives I know were there and are here and there. So we had two and five in this section down here. Uh, sixes are there, there, somewhere there, and no, I can't get the sixes over here, which is a shame. are here, sixes are, threes are in the these squares I should say, three six, three six, what else are we missing, seven, seven four, yeah, kind of suspicious about this top section here but I can't see it sevens ah uh, sorry Thing. Lines like that, okay. Hmm, that wasn't very helpful. No, I'm saying it, not saying anything, so let's put in the pencil marks and finish the game, otherwise the game will be interminably long. Uh, right, now I've forgotten what got... Oh, it's 4-5, of course. Uh, and this is 3 and 8. And we, over here, we need... Oh, I can't remember. Um, 2 and 4, I think it is. And down here we need 7 and 8. Uh, now down here we had seven and nine pair in those squares there and 
ones appear here and there and actually the nines were also in those squares I remember right let's just go through the numbers and see if we can do stuff like this so we've got twos there twos are somewhere down there threes there and what else what else yeah we got three blocking here and three blocking there so threes have to be in the top row section here so threes are there like that which gives me threes in those squares There are fours there. Oops, sorry. Thought I had two squares selected. There we go. A pair of fours there. Fives are there. Sixes. And six blocking like this and across here so we get a pair of sixes there and then a pair of sixes here don't have any completed digits by the way a pair of sevens in those squares done um, okay well uh, I don't have a favorite spot to start but I think I'm gonna have to just go ahead, ahead with it because I don't see any any other new patterns emerging that I hadn't already seen before so I think I should just get on with it so let's see what have we got here one two three four five so what are we missing eight eight blocks up there and we get eights in those squares is that it uh, this is going to be a three, four. Yeah, that's right. That, that three, seven, nine pair there, isn't it? Okay, let's see about fours. Then fours are in those corner squares like that. And what do we know about eights? Eights block like this. So we have eight there. Have I got a single six there? I'm not sure. Uh, let's see. Uh, have we got one? One, two three four five six seven eight nine yeah see it's so difficult when you've got a completely empty cell i can't remember nine numbers even if i know two of them already i can't remember the others so that is a six so that will get rid of the sixes there and when we place a six over there we get a pair of sixes there so that's going to make it much easier because we can remove that nine from there and we can place our nine in there and we'll get nine here and seven there and that'll give us a pair of sevens over there as well um, nine is finished now okay uh, we have a pair of one and six down here so that's going to be a two isn't it which will give us two there and a four there we're immediately moving forwards four blocks this square and up there so it'll give us a pair of fours there which also means fours have to be in those squares which means fours have to be in one of these two squares four blocking across that will be four this will be four this will be three and this will not be four okay Uh, this is the only six possible in this column now, so we'll put the six in there. Uh, and we've got to get rid of this candidate six. I don't think I've put all the candidates in here. There's something missing, isn't there? Four, seven, and eight is the other number missing. Do we know anything about the eights? Uh, maybe not yet, so let's just quickly put in the eight to help us out. 
we need just one more number over here which is a five I believe and we can put five here and a five there and a four in that square four there we'll erase that four okay Right, let's go round again. Ones, how are the twos looking now? Two blocking across there, so we have a pair of twos in those squares there. There's only one possibility for a two here now, that's there. And that will give us a pair of twos, but we have the seven, so now we can look at what's missing in these squares. Uh, we're looking for six and eight in these two squares. Any help on six or eight? No came back the answer. Okay, so we'll put in the 6 and the 8 there. And we'll start this again. 1s, that's no change. 2s. Okay, 3s are where? Ah, okay, that's a 4, that's a 3, and this is not a 3. This is an 8. And I don't think we need to go around anymore. Two there. Eight now blocking this square here. So, oh, that will give us a pair of two and eight in those squares. So this is three, six, and what's the other? We've got, what's the other missing number? Seven. Uh, we're going to have sevens in those squares there. Uh, which means that this can't be seven this must be seven and this is eight and that's our two two seven eight in here three there three there seven there six there So yeah, once you found that single, that was it. It's all over, really. But I find it hard to find a single in a completely empty block, even if I know some of the patterns there. That's it. See you around. Bye-bye.